All right, I have a confession before I started this video. As I'm sure none of you noticed, there's now a Starburst Jelly Beans bag on the top of Chucky's head. Um, I went to the store with the intention of putting that Starburst bag on Chucky's head for no other reason than because I wanted to. Unfortunately, before I cut it open, well, while I was cutting, cutting it open, I forgot that there were Starburst Jelly Beans in the Starburst Jelly Bean bag as I placed it on Chucky's head. Even though I felt them, it didn't register in my brain. So now the entire back of my TV is covered in Starburst Jelly Beans. I know you don't care, and it's nobody's business but mine, nobody's fault but mine, but I just wanted to tell you that. And now we're going to get back to whatever maniac-type nonsense Santa has in store for us. I don't read. I might read it. I'm not going to read it. Haha, <laughs> continue. Oh. Oh, and look at this one. At least this one's sensitivity is isn't absolutely terrible. This sensitivity is nice. It has a good feel to it. Could be a bit higher, but um who cares? Glowing notebook. It's shifting very slightly. And uh there's no need for that. See, all right, I'm willing to bet that they made it like this on purpose, so there's probably going to be some sort of reason for that. Unless Santa's going to get stuck in the chimney, I'm going to have to grab him by his big old boots and yank him down. All right, time to read, I guess. Or not. Oh, no. An evil creature, Alaska folklore, human, human characteristics. Are they talking about Krampus? Ah, uh, skin white, but covered in black fur. They're talking about Krampus. I've gotten the gist of it. I'm, I'm all good. Wait, there was a second page. I'm going to click and see what the second page is. Just... How do I get to the second page? Oh. You know, well, I've gotten all the use out of it that I needed to. Alaskan folklore, black fur. Even if it's not Krampus, it is Krampus. Spare room. Oh, I can't enter the spare room? Mom's room. Bedroom. I can't enter any of these rooms? Why not? This is my house. And I can't enter the rooms in my own home? See, I hate games that don't know how light works. This light would be illuminating much more than this singular table. And there's just lights emanating here from these Christmas lights. I don't know why they chose yellow. Who has yellow Christmas lights? Just a string of yellow Christmas lights. Oh. Alright, well, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Maybe that book was more important than I had thought it was. Maybe not. I'm going to go read the book because it's not giving me any other option. I've tried all the rooms, the bathroom, the spare room. Oh. Did you did? Was that just me? Chucky, you heard that too, right? You heard the sound of Shark Boy banging on top of the roof, right? Um, Krampus? Who are you snarling at? Mom, 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 there seems to be a grizzly bear that's climbed on the roof of our house and is currently attempting to do the breaking and the entering. I don't know if I'm not supposed to be able to interact with these doors or if the interaction with these doors is very limited up until a certain point or if it's just letting me know that these doors exist. I'm going to go to this back door. Thank you for letting me know exactly what I already knew it was. You are the most helpful text in any game that I've ever played. Now, hopefully, there won't be any more crawling or scratching or biting and thrashing around on the roof of my house, and I'm going to go back and read this book and figure out what the hell I'm supposed to be doing. Even though I don't want to read the book. I'm still fighting the need to read this book. Fine, whatever. All right. <sighs> Polar night, though... The what? The corn two? Corn uk two. I'm saying Krampus. Who cares? Krampus the, the Krampus is only said to be seen in the month of November through January during the months 
uh, Alaska experiences a time of darkness known as the Polar Nights. With a okay, I thought I heard something. Sorry. Um, where the sun ceases to rise, it's believed Krampus is unable to attack outside of these months due to its weakness to the sun. That didn't help me. And I would like to note that the only way I'm able to interact with this is this button right here. So I'm assuming that the doors only are interactable with this button too. And I've tried E. So if I go through this and the doors don't open up and I can't do anything, I'm eventually going to start wailing on my keyboard until something happens. Oh, there's more to the polar night. Oh, okay. That says font, not front. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot. Come on, ADHD. Come on, ADHD. Stop doing this to me. Stop doing this to me. Stop doing this to me. My ADHD puts letters and stuff where there aren't because my brain just tries to overcorrect everything because I'm constantly thinking about something and there's at no point in time that I'm ever thinking about nothing except for my ADHD goes all the way on to a thousand and then I'm perpetually stuck thinking about nothing. Excuse me, and I knocked over a bottle. Um, back to what I was doing before. Once the polar night starts, Krampus is said to be starving and begins its hunt, invading people's homes and eating them. Good. Bodes well for me. Uh, it is believed Krampus targets those who built their homes far away from others in secluded places. Uh, thus to be safe from any attack, people should live close to one another. Really? Is that, is that right? Am I reading that right? Or is this my ADHD trying to make me do a backflip again? Okay, well, that's wrong, but Sandman? I was reading my book. Krampus built a Sandman, not a snowman, Sandman. Because that's clearly a face in there. It's a lie. It's Sandman. Spider-Man, come save me. Sandman is outside. Did he get closer? Actually, hold up. I don't think it actually got, it didn't get any closer, did it? I feel like it's actually getting closer. Mom. Mom. No, it's not. Okay. Check the chimney. The campus jumps down, tries to eat me. Mom. Mom, there seems to be a demon outside of our house. Mom's room and bedroom. Krampus, Krampus, you know breaking and enter, entering is a crime, right? Who did this? Who done it? You done it? I don't like that. Close the door. Yeah, close the back door. I heard that. Who's getting shifty? Is it you, snowman? You done getting shifty? No, you're standing still. I didn't check out... Bathroom. I didn't check out this window, and there appears to be some sort of entity at this window as well. What the hell type of demonic ass snow caterpillar? What's happening right now? It's the human centipede with snow! I don't like it. I'm listening for the sound of crunching bones in mom's room, because Krampus is clearly broken into the house. I don't know how somebody who's broken into my house could be so quiet, yet here we are. I'm assuming my back door wasn't locked and I'm sure Krampus just took his big old meat feet and kicked it down. All right. Well, I'm lost for words right now. I don't know what to do. Oh, it's changed. It's changed the snowmen. A sign Krampus is near is finding snowmen, all figures of which are said to have faces of the dead. A smell like human corpses, it's believed such figures will surround your house before Krampus attacks. Another sign it might be near is an extreme feeling of fear, distress with no cause, with no direct cause. Fear and distress with no direct cause. Well, I, just a thought, just a, just a thought. If I were to look outside of my window right now and see that man right there with the face of a corpse, there... 
there is not no cause for my stress, but a very clear and obvious cause for my stress. That's very clearly a scam. That is very clearly a scam. That's a, that's a scam. I'm not going to that chimney until I check the rest of this house, because that is clearly a scam. Come on, Chucky. Come on, Chucky. We're gonna protect mom. Right, Chucky? We're gonna make sure mom is safe? No, we're not. We're giving up. We're gonna be, uh, we're gonna be drawn towards the chimney. Even though we literally ran, not ran, I'm, excuse me, even though we literally read a book detailing what Krampus does to take some butt, even though it's not Krampus, it's Krampus's cousin. I'm gonna... Oh, you black bastard. Please don't take that out of context. Don't take that out of context. I knew that was gonna happen, but it spooked me anyway, so I don't know why. I'm gonna read this now. The children. Krampus always carries a bag made of fur. See, now this is sounding like the SCP thing. I can't remember what the uh, name is right now or what the number is right now, but I'm sure I'll find it eventually. It's Christmas time, so it's gonna be popped up on my YouTube feed sometime. Fur which is used to steal children from the homes it attacks. Houses it attacks, homes it attacks, same difference. It's unknown where the children go when they're taken. Some say Krampus eats their souls. I keep hearing like the sound of skittery little feet. And I don't know if that's in my head or not. It might just be because I'm paranoid. Eats their souls to attain immortality. Others that it keeps them to eat throughout the rest of the year. So like, are you telling me that I'm about to be slapped in a refrigerator and fried up in a saucepan in a few days because i don't like the way that sounds you can eat mom i'm sorry krampus you can eat mom i don't want i don't i don't, I don't want to be involved in this he's eating mom mom i said i was listening for the sound of bone splintering but no i wasn't expecting that Mom's dead. Oh, mom's actually dead. Oh. Sorry about that. Pardon me, mother. Um, pardon me, corpse of mother. If he... Okay, so it eats the adults and then takes the children? Because I was going to say he just slapped mom real hard. And I'm still alive. So, I thought he was going to put mom in his happy sack. It is believed the only way that Krampus can die is to starve to death. So once it finds a house to attack, there is nothing that can be done to stop it. Then why would I build my house all the way out here in the middle of nowhere? If this is like an established thing, that's this, this thing, Swanton bombs down my chimney, snatches up your kids, eats your family, and then ho ho hoes away. Why would I build my house in the middle of nowhere? Don't you jump scare me. Don't do it. Yeah. I was ready. I prepared. Is that my mom? Did you put the face of my mom on a snowman? Hi, mom. Listen, mom. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> so I keep grinding my mom down in the bone mill. My mom is right here. So Krampus! Krampus, Krampus, what, what? That was not Krampus. That was a black shadow with horns that just slunk over to me like this. It walked up to me like it was a Muppet, just. What's wrong with you? I feel offended. What, I built my house all out here in the middle of nowhere. Why did you duct tape my mom's face to a snowman? Why did you have that much time to build a snowman? And why did you put my mom's face on it? Why didn't you just eat the face? Why didn't you just eat the face? And I'm sure there's more ways to kill it than just starving it. Shoot it in the kneecaps with a shotgun. That way it's really just gonna have to get to shuffling after you. Um, I had more fun with this game than I should have. This, this game was genuinely great.